If you study medicine, you've probably kissed this face before. In the 1880s, people in Paris, France came across the dead body of a woman floating in the Seine River. It was completely unknown how she had gone there or who she was, but a pathologist working at the morgue was so captivated by her serene beauty, even in death, that he felt her face had to be preserved. As such, he called her Le Connu de la Seine, or the Unknown Woman of the Seine, and then made a death mask of her face. Sounds insane, I know, but actually pretty common back then. But incredibly, when visitors began seeing her death mask, they were all equally mesmerized by her beauty. People began wanting their own copy of this woman's death mask, and soon it became mass-produced. Some people even said that a whole generation of German girls modeled their looks after her face. But in 1958, a man in Norway had an idea to use Le Connu de la Seine's face to model his CPR training dummy. He wanted to make learning CPR more lifelike and more attractive. And to this very day, CPR dummies all around the world still have her face. She's known as the most kissed face in the world, technically responsible for saving millions of lives, and still, no one has the slightest clue who she is.